Well, continuing with our Labor Day team coverage right now, the holiday travel rush is on. No question, a record number of people are expected to be hitting the roads. And the airports today, they're going to celebrate the end of summer. So let's bring in NBC 10's Minaj Kongwari live at the Newton Rest Stop right now with more on what we can expect. Minaj. Well, it feels like we say this every year, but this really is expected to be one of the busier holiday weekends especially on the road. So you drivers out there, well, start getting up and start getting ready because beginning at noon today, the roads are expected to be packed and they'll stay that way until about 7 p.m. this evening. And for this weekend, AAA says the worst times to drive will be in the middle of the day. They're predicting millions of Americans to commute in part due to low gas prices, especially here in Massachusetts. On average, regular gas prices here are about 10 cents lower than the national average and about 40 cents lower than this time last year. Domestically, we expect travel to be up 9%. Part of that fueled by actual domestic travel costs going down 2% year over year. So it's a sign that inflation is starting to cool off a little bit. Gas prices are lower than they were last year. So that means it's going to be easier for folks to take that trip. Well, as we take a live look inside Logan, Massport, recommending flyers take public transit if you're headed to the airport today. In fact, TSA is predicting today will be Logan's busiest day this weekend for air travel. We say this all the time. You know the drill. You're being asked to arrive two hours early for domestic flights and three hours early for international flights. Going to be a pretty busy weekend, guys. Right now, though, we're live here in Newton. Minash Kongwari, NBC10 Boston.